moving. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Please don't let it go to my face. Oh my gosh. The idea behind Science Day in the Park was to take advantage of a wonderful resource that's available to our school and use it to further the education of our children, especially in science. One of the highlights this year is that we have the cow from the Southwest Dairy Farmers. Just see if she's ready to give us some milk. Yeah, look at there. Okay, now when we get the milk out, we know she's ready to give it to us. We know it looks uh, good and healthy. I learned that they, uh, they only feed their babies milk for two months. I did not know there was a machine to do it. I thought you had to like hand do it, but it was really cool that I learned that there's a machine that could do it. Science Day is a fun educational day. We love it. It's very educational because it's hands-on experience. The kids love it because they're outdoors. They get to experience it firsthand versus in the classroom. It's just another setting where they can um, explore these science concepts. It's really fun to just learn about science and like learn about plants and learn about um, air and earth. Think about how, how water's gonna travel. High end to low end. It was actually fun because it was my first time being able to work with pipes and figure out how the water moves to different places. <laughs> Hang on to that pipe! I love this activity because they have to use teamwork and um, they all have to work together because every part plays an important role. And so the students hold up these pipes and the goal is to waste as little water or not waste any water at all while the water goes flows through the pipes. At the same time, they're learning how the system, the solids water system works and how we get our water. Because it's a team effort and I can't do it by myself and neither can my friends. It takes a lot of people. All right, good. I learned how to save water and how to get water to people. By getting outside and letting them experience science firsthand instead of reading about it or just doing activities in the classroom, they actually learn to appreciate the nature, the science, the things that are available around them. 